you do what you do to me. Toffer is the real thing, and he's working so hard to make this project a success. And I'm just, I'm really, you know, grateful to him for doing that because I think it makes this whole community so much better to have that farm there. And everyone is welcome to go there and see the cows and touch the cows and see the pigs and, you know, it's just, it makes life in this town so much better. Is the only certain thing. I trust that in this rare and bright connection, we're stronger when we take things day by day by day. We're stronger when we take things day by day. It's really fun to work with Toffer and the other interns. They're just like really nice and you can just walk into the milking room and ask them questions while they're milking. It's really great. And they'll be like, yeah, sure. That you love me. You're all so pretty lucky I love you. I love Cricket Creek Farm and I think it's a really important resource in the Northern Berkshire County, but I also am aware that it's tough to run a dairy farm today and, and many farms are struggling and that people have to get really creative about how they bring in revenues to support this terrific goal of having local cheese and local milk and, and really a beautiful, scenic, bucolic setting. Um, so I greatly admire that Cricket Creek Farm is contemplating turning a beautiful old stone bar into an event space where, um, you know, a few nights a year people can have weddings there. It makes them very, very happy and all of the revenues from that rental can go right into those calves. We're stronger when we take things day by day by day. We're stronger when we take things. The most unique thing about Cricket Creek Farm is that it is here. Because it's the only one. In Williamstown, there are no other artisan cheese producers. There is no other option for school children or college students from Williams to be able to see a dairy operation in action producing a value added product like cheese. I've been to Cricket Creek Farm a number of times um, to buy milk, to buy eggs, cheese, um, to visit with Toffer and Susie and Matthew and, and the whole crew here. We got to see just how good a job they do in their grazing of the dairy cattle and we got to learn about their creamery and the way they make the milk and so on. So it was really a great opportunity to get over here to Cricket Creek and, and see what makes this place tick. You can't expect farms to stay in operation and lose money. Um, and Cricket Creek has done a really good job of cutting their losses in the past few years and they're becoming more and more financially viable but it's next to impossible to survive as the dairy farm without some other source of income coming in. And they've done a really good job of it. They have the CSA, they're making cheese, but everything they do requires a lot of capital investment. And just owning all that land is expensive and there are a lot of costs. And one way that, that they and other farms like them can support their operations is by having events. And so by renovating this barn and having a really great rentable event space, that will help them become more financially viable. They're going to have a window right here, but on the other side, and right there, but on the other side, and maybe do something with the cupola up there, um, and open up that window really big. So it's just um, going to be really, really great. I think everyone in the community should be interested in supporting the Kickstarter uh, project here at Cricket Creek Farm because it is so critical to the farm 
to reach out to the community and it's a way for them and the community to come together on a variety of ways, not just through the purchase of um, products there, but to create a real community interest and investment in the farm so that everybody feels responsible for helping the farm to continue to grow um, and, and carry out its sustainable and um, delicious practices. Some people ask why invest in Kickstarter? And I don't view Kickstarter really as an investment of the traditional kind where you're hoping to make money back and get a dividend or interest or get a profit out of it. Because Kickstarter almost guarantees you from the start that you're not gonna make a profit. What it is, it's a guarantee that you're investing in something that means something to you or your community or the world at large. Sometimes it could be a film, about a very socially important topic, or it could be about expanding an opportunity on a farm, as I've invested in a prior Kickstarter project, and will invest in this one to make the farms that we have more viable. And it isn't going to be that I'm going to make money off of this, but it's that we're going to be contributing something back to our community, back to our society, that will give a long-term benefit to the community in having these assets available and viable going into the future. How do you support this project? Share this video, call your mother, post it on Facebook, tweet about it, Insta re-Instagram, re-Instagram, look at Cricket Creek Farm's Instagram page. How can you not support those cows' faces? They are adorable. And the pigs, come on. Tell all your friends. We're lucky to have a farm in our community that is so active and part of who we are as a community. To keep the farm going, to keep these young farmers in our community, to bring more people to the farm. So support Cricket Creek Farm in their Kickstarter campaign. It's time to make some music bright And it's time to make this land feel bright And it's time to use our hands for right And make this place feel right tonight One, two, three